my name is Stephen Fraser and I'm the director of the short animated documentary Prosopagnosia. The film is part of the Perspectives competition at Annecy 2022. Prosopagnosia looks at my experiences of face blindness and uses a variety of animation techniques to tell the story. It was filmed in the first six months of 2021 but looks back at over a decade's worth of diaries, photographs and drawings. Now, prosopagnosia means face blindness, and this means that when I see a face, I find it difficult to determine who that person is. I first realised I had a form of prosopagnosia when I was receiving a diagnosis of autism. At this time, I had a compulsion to understand what a face is. The eyes, the ears, the nose, the mouth, for example. And I started keeping diaries written diaries and audio diaries which documented my experiences. I also started to sketch different people's faces. So I'd go into a coffee shop, take out my sketch pad and I would just draw. When doing this, I realised this helped me a lot and what a face actually looks like became clearer to me. Eventually, I realised I had all these sketches, drawings, diaries and photographs, so I put them together into a memory box. Within the film, I take a personal and intimate approach to the topic of prosopagnosia. I open up this memory box to see what's inside and the content of the box is the basis of the film. The animation techniques I used were very important to me. Face blindness does not manifest itself physically. You cannot touch it or hold it, yet for me it is very real. Therefore, the animation techniques I used were all tactile and I manipulated objects that I could touch and hold. I really wanted this story to show what it feels like to live with prosopagnosia, not suffering from prosopagnosia. Neurodiversity has been shown on film many times, but most of the films I've seen come from an outsider's perspective. You have this outsider point of view of the filmmaker trying to get into the head of the protagonist. And this was not a concern to me. I had my own insider's perspective and I was letting people know what this is. For me, the best type of art is when the artist is telling the audience a secret. It's when they open up their diaries and let people in. And that's what I attempted to do with my short animation, Prosopagnosia. Mm -hmm.